Hi, this is Miss Chandler again, and I'm going to show you how to use some new tools on Seesaw. So let's go look and see what we'll be working with today. So in your assignments, when you go, you are going to, once you're in your class, you're going to see the assignments that your teacher has assigned to you. You're going to click that green button, add response, and this is the one we're going to look at today. You're going to find your name. I'm going to say my name is Susan. All right, so it says, hello. Today, let's practice tracing lines with the pen tool. I also want you to find the letters to type your name in the box. So there's two new things that we're going to work with today. The first is my name is, I've got to put my name in here. Remember, I said my name is Susan, so I've got to type it in. That sounds very cool. So we're going to go to this T. I'm going to flash it. One, two, three. There it is, that big T, that one that has a line down and a cross at the top. We're going to click that, and that's going to let you, if you're on an iPad or a, um, a phone, you're going to see it on a little keyboard. Okay? I'm on the computer, so I'm going to, I have my box right here. You see, it looks kind of weird. And I'm going to go ahead and type my name. I'm going to type it first before I try to move my box. And I said my name is Susan. So I'm going to write that. I'm going to type it up. I'm going to find my first letter for Susan S. There's an S, Susan. And if you want to worry about a capital, lowercase, you can, but you don't have to. We're just learning, so it's fine. So I've got an S. And then I'm going to put a U, S, A, N, Susan. Now, my name is not in the box, so I have got to move it. So I'm going to click my box, and if you're on an iPad or a... Um, phone, you're going to use your finger to move it, but with my I'm on my computer, I'm going to use my mouse or my trackpad to put my name. I can also resize it and make it bigger to fit in the box by pulling those dots. If you're on an iPad or a phone, you're going to use your fingers to fit it in there. You're going to drag it to where it needs to go, stretch it to where it needs to fit, or shrink it if it needs to, to fit in the box. So I've got the name. Now I've got to go to the next step. I'm going to be tracing these lines, but I've got to get the right tool. We've talked about this tool where we use it and we drag things, but we're not using that tool. We're going to use the pen. So we're going to go look at the bottom of the screen, and I've got my, it's on this one right now, and I'm going to move it over to the pen. I've got the pencil. The pencil could work too. It makes it a real fine line, very skinny, but I'm going to go to my pen. That's this one right here. I'm going to highlight it. And there's other tools you could use. You could use a highlighter or a glow one, but let's use the pen, okay? And if we make a mistake, we can use the eraser. Remember the eraser, when we, we have a mark and we wanna get rid of it, we'll use the eraser. So let's go back to the pen, and I'm just gonna use the blue that's on there right now. And if you're on a iPad or a phone, you'll use your finger to trace those lines. If you're on a computer, I'm gonna click it and use the mouse to make that line, or I'll use the trackpad to make that line. So I click it, and then I hold it down as I go. Okay, so I'm gonna take the worm all the way to the apple. I'm I've got it clicked down. Oh, it's hard to stay on those lines. Oh, but I can do it, I can do it, I can do it. Oh, can I get to that apple? Oh, I almost am almost there. Oh, I got off a little bit. Let's get back on there. Oh, I made it. I think it's close enough. I'm going to go ahead and go to the next one. It's hard to stay on those lines. So now I think I want to change my color. Do you remember how I told you you can change that color and you just have to move that dot to a different color? So say I want to change it to red. And I'm going to take the moose to the blueberry. And I'm going to draw a line from the moose to the blueberry. Here I go. Uh-oh, I made a mistake. Do you remember how I told you to fix that mistake? I can get my eraser. And then I'm going to just go over that line. But now I'm going to go back to my pen because I'm going to get that moose to the blueberry. I'm going to go down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, and down to the blueberry. Uh-oh, I went too far. I'm going to get my eraser again. And I'll erase it. Going back to the pen. Now let's get a purple. 
this one looks like a roller coaster. Man, I'd like to go on a roller coaster. And we're gonna go, we're gonna slide down and then we're gonna slide back up. I gotta get back on that line. Slide down, slide down and back up. And we're getting the little boy to his coffee cup here. It looks like an iced coffee. He must want some iced coffee. All right. So then I am done. I have my name typed. Remember, I hit the T to type it, and then I use my fingers or my mouse to fit it in the box. And then I use my pen tool to trace it. You're going to be using your pen tool in the next couple of assignments. So I want to make sure we get some practice in tracing and using those pen tools and an eraser when you have any trouble with it. All right, now remember when we want to send it to our teacher, we're going to hit that check mark and it goes to our teacher. It's uploading to her so she can see the awesome job you did. There it is. And then the teacher's going to approve it and let you know how well you did. I hope this helped you. And you have, if you have any problems with this assignment, be sure to let your teacher know so she can help you. And remember how to use those tools. The drag and drop we've gone over, the pen, the camera, and now the typing too, where we get to put in the letters. All right, we'll see you next time.